In the current climate, you'd expect most of us to be planning a cost-cutting Christmas. But for the team at gettingpersonal.co.uk, business is booming despite the recession. Well, we've been very fortunate, actually. Um, we found that although um, there's a lot of doom and gloom in terms of the news stories out there, our business has grown almost 75% um, this year. Christmas trading is very strong for us, um, but I think it's because we're offering the types of products that you can't buy anywhere else on the internet. They're on course to break the £1 million profit barrier for the year, a real success for a small firm that was born when two men met at an antenatal class. We expanded our range through mugs and posters and notebooks, uh, and we now do personalised greeting cards too. And we found that it was that level of innovation that really drove the success of the business. Gifts are flying off the shelves here, and it's firms just like this one in South Manchester that seem to be riding the financial storm. Today, the Federation of Small Businesses say it's innovation like this that's making all the difference. Well, as you can imagine, with a big business, you almost have to have a board meeting for, for uh, serious decisions uh, about new products and new services. Many small businesses um, almost turn on a sixpence, if people remember what a sixpence was. Uh, they can respond very quickly to um, the needs of the customer. Look for new ideas, discuss those new ideas directly with the customer, go away and in very short order put those into practice and put those out there as goods and services. Because we're a small business and it's myself and my brother who own it and run it, we're basically on site to project manage, you know, and if something comes up, i.e. the floor in this property which was damaged, you're there to make a decision and to rectify it properly and discuss with the customers, obviously, what the end outcome's going to be, what you're doing, and so on and so forth. Small businesses these days make up 60% of our economy, and the FSB says small firms are leading the way out of recession and back into growth. Michael Billington, Channel M Today.